University of Buford rolls into White County for a Region 8-4A matchup. Wolves coming off a loss to McEachern. They've had a couple weeks to think about it. 41 game win streak snap. Time to start a new one. Warriors a monumental task beating Buford like nailing Jello to the wall. Brandon Marsh gets Buford near the goal line and Martin Mangrum does the rest. 7-0 Buford on the first offensive series. Mangrum would have a solid night, as would the Wolves' defense. Shug Frazier, four-star recruit, Buku's of offers on the table. Warriors just ran into a buzzsaw all night. And then check out Mick Roof. Still in the first, he finds Jacob Martin down the far side and just about gets in. Inches away from the goal line, leave it to Mangrum. His second score of the quarter, Buford up 14 Zippo. Check out the hit here, though, by Adam Johnson. On the punt, he lays the wood to Anthony Grant, rung his bell a little bit there, and then back to Buford. Checks down to Mangrum. He picks up a huge chunk of real estate, again has the Wolves in the red zone. This time, it's Christian Turner, the sophomore from four ticks out, 21-0 Buford. Grant Wildcat formation calls his own number and scores. This one, though, will come back. Big break for White County. Warriors get a little offensive rhythm late in the half. Caleb Crane picks up 30 yards, longest play from scrimmage of the night for White County. Dane Quinn then finds Clancy Loudermilk for a nice game, but they'd force the punt with less than a minute left in the half. Plenty of time for the Wolves. Roof over the top. Brandon Marsh, 25 yards, touchdown Buford. Beats the buzzer with eight seconds to go in the half. Wolves crash the White County homecoming 49-3, your final.